Welcome to the Spoken Tutorial on Advanced Matrix Operations. In this tutorial, you will learn to find Frobenius and Infinity Norm of a Matrix, find Singular Value Decomposition of a Matrix. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux 16.04 Operating System, Python 3.4.3, and IPython 5.1.0. To practice this tutorial, you should know about lists, arrays, and accessing parts of arrays, and performing basic matrix operations. If not, see the relevant Python tutorials on this website. First, we will see about flatten function. Flatten function returns a copy of the array collapsed into one dimension. It can be used to convert a multi-dimensional matrix into a single dimension matrix. Let us start IPython. Open the terminal. Type IPython3 and press Enter. From here onwards, remember to press the Enter key after typing every command on the terminal. Now let us see how to create arrays. Type from numpy import as matrix comma arrange. 3 is equal to as matrix inside brackets arrange inside brackets 1 comma 10 dot reshape inside brackets 3 comma 3. Then type a. Now type a dot flatten open and close brackets. First, we imported arrange function from numpy module. Here we can see 3 by 3 matrix is converted into one dimensional matrix. Next, we will see about Frobenius norm. It is defined as the square root of the sum of the absolute squares of its elements. Pause the video. Try this exercise and then resume the video. Find out the Frobenius norm of the inverse of the given 4 by 4 matrix. Switch back to the terminal for the solution. Type M is equal to AS matrix inside brackets arrange inside brackets 1 comma 17 dot reshape inside brackets 4 comma 4. Here we have used AS matrix arrange and reshape functions. We created a matrix of size 4 by 4 containing elements from 1 to 16. Now type M inside square brackets 0, 1 is equal to 0. M inside square brackets 1, 3 is equal to 0. Then type M. We changed the value of the element at row 0, column 1 and row 1, column 3 to 0. In order to find out the Frobenius norm of the inverse of a matrix, M, type as shown. Norm function is available in numpy.lanalg module. Next, we will see about infinity norm of a matrix. It is defined as the maximum value of the sum of the absolute value of elements in each row. Pause the video. Try this exercise and then resume the video. Find the infinity norm of the matrix IM. Switch back to the terminal for the solution. To find out the infinity norm of the matrix IM, type as shown. Here value for ORD parameter is passed as INF to calculate infinity norm. To know more about norms, type norm question mark. Press Q to exit. Next, we will see about singular value decomposition. In linear algebra, the singular value decomposition is factorization of real or complex matrix. The SVD of matrix M1 can be found using SVD function available in the numpy.lanalg module. Type as shown. SVD returns a tuple of three elements. 
we have unpacked these values into variable u, sigma and v underscore conjugate. Type capital U. Type sigma. Type capital V underscore conjugate. We can validate the singular value decomposition by comparing the product of u, sigma and v underscore conjugate with m1. Sigma is a one-dimensional array which contains only the diagonal elements of the matrix. Type as shown. We first convert this array to a matrix. Type SMAT. SMAT is a 2 by 3 0 matrix. Now type SMAT inside square brackets colon 2 comma colon 2 is equal to DIAG inside brackets sigma. Then type SMAT. This replaces values at row 0, column 0 and row 1, column 1 in SMAT with values from sigma. SMAT is a 2 by 3 matrix created for multiplication by placing values of sigma as diagonal elements and 0 elsewhere. Type as shown. It returns true. It means elements in M1 and in product of U, Sigma and V underscore conjugate are equal. This brings us to the end of this tutorial. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we have learned to calculate the norm of a matrix using the function norm. Calculate SVD of a matrix using the function SVD. Here is a self-assessment question for you to solve. Norm inside brackets A, comma, ORT is equal to inside single course FRO is same as norm inside brackets A. True or false? And the answer is true. Since the order is equal to inside single course FRO stands for Frobenius norm. Please post your timed queries in this forum. Please post your general queries on Python in this forum. FOSI team coordinates the TBC project. Spoken Tutorial project is funded by NMEICT MHRD Government of India. For more details, visit this website. This is Priya from IIT Bombay signing off. Thanks for watching.